legend. What was the highlight of that for you? On the way there, I ran into Michael Mann. Yes. He's also an officer of some kind of the academy, yeah. as well as being one of the great directors ever. And yeah. It was one of those things where you think, who would have thought I would have been talking directing with Michael Mann? That is one of the seminal moments in my life. You know, well, I was watching Heat with like a <laughs> shitty VCR in Los Feliz and a you know, bootleg tape, and I get to talk to him. Ten years ago, um, I probably wouldn't be presenting at some of these events. <laughs> and, uh, and now, you know, I'm invited. And that feels really good. You know, it's, it's, in this business, you have to work really hard all the time, in my experience. I'm not one of these guys who's so talented that I can show up with my eyes closed and right. do something great. I have to dedicate myself and kill myself every day. Um, and I, that's a good feeling, you know. 40 years old, uh, have three kids, and have found a place in my life. Succeed or fail in the business where I feel like I know where I want to go, and I know how I need to to uh, conduct myself to get there. Argo has, at this point, won virtually every award that there is. DGA, SAG, PGA. Well, no. <laughs> well, sorry, but DGA, PGA, SAG, Critics' Choice, Globes. People obviously really love it, and they've been learning about it, and, and what you have to tell them about the world, and start a conversation. But now, with ballots going out on Friday, this whole thing kind of coming to a close, is there one thing that you would like people to know about Argo that they may not already know? I'm proud of telling Tony Mendez's story yeah. uh, and bringing that to people he never thought uh, would be out there and now people can hear about it. I'm really proud of uh, uh, talking about the State Department and the CIA yeah. and the people who serve overseas for us and telling that story. And I'm really, on a personal level, the experience of watching this movie with an audience has been unlike anything I've done in my whole career. Yeah. It's just a sense of like being connected and having fun and, and, and feeling it. And, uh, you know, to be able to enjoy it and also talk about stuff like Iran yeah. is, is one of the most meaningful experiences in my life. And so I'm, I'm going into it. Um, I know we're not the biggest or whatever movie, but I love the movie. And I love people who work so hard to, to, to make it. And uh, I love the people that it's about. Yep. And, you know, this is probably once in a lifetime experience for me. So it's an honor to be nominated as a producer.